it's something that really helps any person who is moving abroad who does like to be uncomfortable kind of strange right five advantages of moving abroad let's be positive and think at the advantages that such a movement such a change in our life uh, could generate hey guys today's video is gonna be a little different from what uh, you have seen on my channel because I'm planning to just sit here and speak with you guys usually I'm just going places but today's topic it's a little more about life and life decision as you have seen probably from the title today we're gonna go and dig into five benefits five advantages of moving abroad it's a strange topic on my channel right but you would ask why why are you speaking about moving abroad hey well because it's happening it's happening for me i will be moving abroad soon it's not yet the case because i'm still here but it's gonna happen soon 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 and i had so much time to think about it to think about the advantages to think about the disadvantages to think about uh what could lean me toward the decision and what could lean me toward another decision in today's video i'm not gonna speak at all about the disadvantages because um, i want to go through the experience to be able to speak about even for the advantages it's a little strange because it did not yet happen but what i can tell you is what i thought about it the mind the the, the, the thought behind it and um, i really think that for me these advantages these five advantages were the ones that helped me decide and don't get me wrong i have no experience with moving abroad this will be my first time and uh, it's gonna be quite a journey uh, perhaps some of you uh, you can let me know in the comments down below perhaps some of you with more experience in this matter can tell me other advantages uh, to the list uh, to the five that i'm gonna mention but for me uh i it's just an opinion that i uh have uh, from a person who is in process of moving and uh, this was not easy uh decision was not coming with a history behind uh, coming with things that i will leave behind for me to be able to make this move um, it was not easy but we're not speaking about easy or hard right we're speaking about the five advantages so let me start with the first advantage that i think it's it's something that really helps any person who is moving abroad and it helps at the personal level uh, it helps grow as a human being and the first benefit the first advantage would be the change of scenery and culture the fact that you will have to discover new food new people uh, new new way of living new traditions everything is gonna be new for me i believe i honestly believe that it's an advantage and why because it's forcing you to evolve it's forcing you to hit with your head <laughs> uh, on the upper side of the door or how do you say it uh, it forces you to be be adaptable and uh, to try and ensure that you understand where you are you understand what you need to do uh, the fact that um, uh, you need to uh, adapt by implementing different ideas different thoughts into your uh, daily life we move on to the second one the second benefit is developing new skills and uh, this is really really related with the mindset that you have when you go and move abroad uh, you might have to adapt according to the culture as i mentioned earlier and uh, for this you will need different kinds of skills as you might know if you're going to interviews and if you you know experienced going to different interviews for different uh, companies abroad for example 
you will notice that there is a difference between what a recruiter might want from a certain area of the globe and what another recruiter from another area of the globe would want in terms of uh, recruitment. So what I mean by developing new skills, ensuring that at the moment when you are abroad, you at least are open to learn new skills, skills that may help you there. I'm not saying that the skills that you acquire until the moment you're moving are not great. They are, don't get me wrong, they are. They're gonna help you. I think they're gonna help me, but I'm convinced that I for sure need to um, develop new ones. And it may be challenging, and the fact that you're moving abroad may challenge you in this respect, but uh, I really think it's really beneficial for you as a person. Now, the age might be a factor. Um, don't get me wrong, you can be okay at any age when you're deciding to move abroad. Uh, it's a decision that you can and only you can take for your own life. I think I'm convinced that everyone is able to overpass any difficulties that are coming with the movement but I think it's a little harder to do it the more you uh, gain experience and the more you gain years into your uh, age. And um, I'm 30 uh, something, <laughs> 30 something. I don't consider myself neither young or old to do these kinds of change into my life, but I know that the 20 years old me would have been more open or would have processed this kind of change easier. And this is all because of everything that you have built until the moment you decide to move. Uh, once with the movement, unfortunately, you will have to leave behind some things. And I'm not even uh, speaking about family. I want to take it out of discussion. I don't want to discuss about this because that's the hardest thing to leave behind. But let's refer to the easier parts. Let's refer to, um, I don't know, uh, objects, uh, clothes, uh, uh, even, uh, you know, a home, a car. Uh, you might leave behind even, uh, uh, I don't know, uh, a career. A career is important and if you're lucky enough to go with a job, uh, that's that's great if you have a continuation of the of the job but not everyone is lucky enough to do so right so you have to start from zero again with your career and uh, sometimes unfortunately to some countries to some areas of the world from what i heard maybe i'm wrong let me know in the comments down below from what i heard whatever you did until this point it's almost equals zero and it makes sense in a way because they cannot really really prove whatever you're putting in your cv as long as you don't you know um, demonstrate them so you might have to leave all these things behind and i think with age you're gathering more and more stuff so it's going to be harder and harder this is my own opinion uh, I'm not saying it's impossible, for sure it's possible and I think sometimes with age comes more um, more skills, it comes uh, with skills that will help you adapt faster, it could be the case. So um, yeah, this was the second uh, advantage. The third advantage that I think is really helpful is the fact that you'll have to learn a new language or improve a new language. Uh, in my case, luckily, I don't have to learn a new language. I just need to improve one that I already know, English meaning. Uh, but for some, we'll need to improve or learn a new language. And I really think this is cool. It keeps your mind active and um, it's a personal growth to me. 
it's very very useful to know how to express yourself in perhaps a different language than your mother tongue so yeah this would be the simple third advantage that i see that you might gain once you are moving abroad the fourth element that i really think uh, it's beneficial for the life of a person uh, it's a little strange uh, and maybe it's a little personal uh, and i may be subjective on this point because that's how i'm functioning uh, but for me from what i've seen until now at this point in my life i've seen that i'm functioning better when a challenge is involved so tell me that it's something ch challenging tell me that i need to do something because of this and i might do it um of course if it brings if it brings uh, any added value but i'm functioning more on a challenge mode um i'm not sure if this is correct way to function or if it's wrong or if it's good but this is how i am and moving abroad i feel like it's just this thing it challenges you it challenges your mind to react to be able to do new things uh to to even even taking yourself moving yourself in front of a uh, i don't know a closet and try and pack your clothes in i don't know two three suitcases the entire life to put it in two three luggages it's mind-blowing it's so so challenging for me and i really think with the challenge it comes only beneficial things the fact that you have to go outside your comfort zone i really really think it's an advantage at least for me and i am looking forward for it kind of strange right i mean who does like to be uncomfortable apparently me i don't know let me know if you are the same but sometimes i feel like i need to be uncomfortable in order to move forward if i'm too comfortable i'm getting way too unproductive and the fifth advantage and my final point i really think that moving abroad is helping you change perspectives it's helping you uh, change i don't know thoughts even your own education and it can be anything from cultural beliefs to language beliefs to even um, i don't know um what can it be diversity okay any kinds of beliefs and any kinds of uh, um, perspective that you gained until that moment when you moved it might shift once you move and i really think it's an advantage for your personal growth and why it's because sometimes it's good to have an open mind it's good to to at least analyze our beliefs um, you might have a certain perspective due to the lifestyle that you had until that moment due to your education uh, due to any factor you might have to reconsider once you're moving abroad and i really think this is one beneficial thing for yourself i believe that these are the main five advantages that at least i see until this point in uh, my uh, life it would be interesting to re-see this video or redo this video in a certain amount of time uh, following my movement maybe my uh, perspective will change maybe it's gonna be different uh, in a couple of uh, months one year and uh, maybe i'll consider to to redo it after a while with a little bit of experience uh, maybe i'm naive now who knows but 
I like to see the positive and uh, stop with the negative guys. I know everywhere in this world, everything is negative. There's something negative at all time. There's something can happen, but let's be positive and think at the advantages that such a movement, such a change in our life uh, could generate and let's learn from it. I am curious if you are as me on the edge of moving or you perhaps did it already i would be curious to know how did you cope with it what did you do or what are the advantages or even disadvantages that made you decide to do it or not to leave it in the comments and let's make a conversation out of it there are gonna be much more videos to come about this topic i will let you know where i'm going why i'm going uh, how i decided to go whenever i'm going but for now let's just see the positive and uh, on my side um, it was great to be here once again and i thank you for uh, being here with me and i'll see you to the next one Mwah.